Right now at Appalachian Wireless, you can get the Samsung Galaxy S7 for just $99.99 and get a second one free. Service agreement is required on both devices, serving you for the last 25 years with better service and bigger savings at today's Appalachian Wireless. After receiving four bomb threats within a two-week period, an informational assembly was held at Mingo Central High School today to let students know small actions can have big consequences. The West Virginia State Police, West Virginia Fire Marshals, Mingo County Sheriff's Office, Mingo County Prosecuting Attorney, and the Mingo County Schools Superintendent each spoke at today's assembly. Each representative enlightened students about what actually happens when a bomb threat occurs and why it could be a tough situation for everyone, even if the threat is fake. It takes officers overtime. It takes officers going from what could be a serious call of a domestic situation or anything that could be actually helping someone saving their life into a situation of a kid, kid who wanted to get out of school and wrote a note. Um, so we need that to stop in a very real way very soon. Officials today said students may not understand the consequences of something they think is a joke. It's a very, very serious crime, and we're, that's what we're here today uh, to do, to hopefully inform them and make them understand that it's not just a slap on the wrist. This is very serious and very long-term consequences for anybody who makes it on threat. Officials thought today's assembly was successful and very informative to the students. I think the kids were very receptive. Uh, their behavior was really uh, on point, they listened, and I, I think we accomplished our goal as far as getting the information out and letting them know that we care. Making a bomb threat, whether it is false or not, is a felony offense in the state of West Virginia. Reporting in Del Barton for EKB News, I'm Shelby Steele.